Hey guys, it's Lucy here, um, day five of Vida. So I'm still in the game, still going strong, um, still watching all of your videos. I'm trying to keep up with them all. Um, but yeah, I'm having a lot of fun with this. Um, so anyways, let's talk a bit about my day. Um, it's quite an interesting day actually. It started off quite normal. I went into work and um, that was just really normal. Apart from this crazy, crazy guy that came in who um, was having a long chat with me about canoeing. And his name was Colin, so therefore his nickname shall be Colin the Canoe Man for obvious reasons. Um, but no, he was a really nice guy and he cheered me up a bit because I was feeling so tired this morning and so just that I didn't have any energy at all. I didn't think I was going to get through the day, but I did. Um, so yeah, and then at work, um, they've changed my one of my shifts, which has actually worked in my favour because at the moment I'm doing a Monday night which would be fine except for I do the Tuesday morning straight after and um I don't know I don't really like it that much but they've changed my shift to the Monday morning now which is quite good because then I get like an evening to recover from work if you like but yeah um so I had a bit of an amusing incident last night. <laughs> I was selling um, this girl a packet of cigarettes and she was paying by card. But when I asked her if she wanted to any cash back, she gave me a funny look and, um, and asked me what I said. And so I repeated it and then she thought, oh, I thought you said, did I want a nicotine patch? <laughs> Which was quite funny and embarrassing at the same time because that's not the sort of question you'd want to ask to someone who's buying cigarettes, obviously, because it sounds as if you're being sarcastic. But I didn't ask that, so it's fine. Um, <laughs> so anyway, after work, I got on a bus, which is not an unusual event, except this bus was actually jam-packed with school kids. And I don't have a thing against school kids. I'm sure some of them are perfectly nice. But these ones, oh... It was a tiny bus and they just did not move up the bus and it's so annoying. But um, I find when I finally did get a seat, I sat down, plugged in my iPod and James Blunt and Wizard Rock songs got me through it. So, yeah. So, I got the bus to um, meet some old school friends, which was really lovely. Um, I got there quite early, so I went in a shop and bought these things, which is awesome. Um, I don't think I've actually had this flavour before, the wild cherry and watermelon, but they're really nice. I like, I, I normally have the, what are they, the, uh, the grape ones, grape and lemon, I think, I'm not quite sure about that, but these ones are nice. Um, so then I met up with my friends some of my best friends from school uh who I don't get to see a lot um I hadn't seen them since last summer so that was really really lovely and we went to the cinema to see Shallow Girl which is a really good film I recommend it to you um so go see that and um, it's really funny and then we went for a meal in um Chiquitos afterwards so it was a great evening and um this video is quite late I'm just about gonna make it I think but yeah, um, so as soon as I'm doing a little sort of question to you all, well I seem to be doing that um, at the end of my videos, the question for today I'm going to ask I think is, if you're having a bad day or if you're getting stressed or something, what gets you through the day? I mean like for me today I listen to James Blunt and Wizard Rock songs and it calmed me down somehow. So what what does it feel? I mean do you plug in your iPod and listen to songs? Do you go to the gym, do you go, I don't know, what do you do, let me know in the comments and I will see you tomorrow.